It's not no human cod fighting. It's more like it's it's more like a whole bushido samurai type deal. You know, you train your best. Be the best takes a lot of practice and dedication. Obeno was drawn to martial arts at a very early age. MMA, it was something like I always liked as a kid. My dad was a boxer, and um, he used to mess around with me a lot when I was real young. I mean, when I was six, I saw the very first UFC on TV, and like from the age of six, I was like, I'm gonna be there someday. I wanted to be there. Soon after, my dad got me into boxing. I started wrestling a little bit, and then. It just picked up from there. It was something I always enjoyed. It was fun, like competition-wise. I didn't go out to like you know try to hurt somebody on purpose, but it was just the competition of it. Win, lose, or draw, you're still a good sport. After the first day, I was hooked. I had to come back and just keep coming, and now it's like I got like a whole new family up here. Joshua Bana is fighting in the premier fight night. He's all fired up to get in the ring. Oh, I'm psyched. This this week is just going by too slow for me right now. This I think this past day at work well, it was longer than the past three weeks I've been waiting since I first came here. You know, your nerves are ready to go, you're ready to go. And then, you know, you try not to be too overexcited before you get the adrenaline dump. And then I just, you know, have a poor fight. Whether you win or lose a battle, Obina believes you can always come out on top. You train for the worst and the best always comes, and that's what you do every day. And when you come out to fight, that's testing you and your heart and your soul and your, your pretty much your whole technique and your skill. And, you know, if you lose, you know, you can't take it hard, it's just, it happens to everyone. All the greatest champions have lost and they've all come back stronger. If you can lose, and you can lose a man, then that just makes you a lot stronger than, you know, some of the guys out there who lose and then they cry about it later.